But I saw a tweet today from FaZe Fleet talking about how like so many of the niches when it comes to Fortnite have pretty much died. All the niches that used to get a lot of views just aren't as popping as they used to be. And the one that I'm most familiar with is like is creative. Dude, I remember when you used to be able to upload a creative map and it would just creative was just so, you know, so exciting and it was so new. And I feel like we'll get back to a point like that if Fortnite manages to come out with, you know, creative 2.0 or whatever like modding is going to be because I, I, I think the modding rumors are still true. I, I think Fortnite is still going to come out with modding at some point, which I think would do amazing things for the life cycle of Fortnite. If they release mod tools, sort of like what Call of Duty did for Black Ops 3 Zombies, it would be amazing if they had allowed for individuals to make, you know, truly custom maps or game modes. Like if they gave people truly free reign, if they gave everyday users um, the, like the same tools that Fortnite uses to actually develop game modes and maps. You and I probably would understand that, but there'd be a group of people out there who would understand how to use those tools and be able to make some really cool stuff. But yeah, that'd be so cool if they, if they came out with something like that. It'd be so great for the life cycle of Fortnite. But as of right now, it, it feels like the only content that really gets views is just kind of like, I, like I, we kind of talked about this yesterday where it's just like content that's literally kind of like news stuff or content that's kind of just like made for, I don't want to say kids because it just sounds like insulting or like I'm belittling it, which like, you know, get the bread, get the views whenever you want. I just don't like to make content like that. And I feel like there's some creators that also kind of share that that vision, that opinion, where it's like, I don't want to make like fashion show, hide and seek, you know, kind of content too much anymore. It's just not creatively rewarding and that's already been done. So it's just not like fun to do. It doesn't feel like new or creative or anything like that. So, you know, I don't want to release a video titled like, you know, S I pretended to be a secret Columbus skin and, you know, and pranked my friends and this is what happened. I, I, I literally blow my brains out, dude. Know what I mean? I'm hoping there's a bit of, there's another high left for, for Fortnite content. And I think there is. I think at some point Fortnite will have another another high when they release some next big major update. Like think about what Playground did for Fortnite and then what Creative did. And I, I think there will be some next edition of Creative where they do like Creative 2.0. You know, it won't be called that. They won't like change the name of Creative or make a separate game mode, but It'll be like the next generation of creative. That's just a guess though. I don't know. Maybe they won't do modding and all those rumors have been lies, but it'd be so cool if they were real. Uh, Brody, thank you so much for the dollar, man. I appreciate that. I don't know if that donut popped up on screen, um, but I appreciate the support, man. Thank you so much.